All right, guys, we're gonna go and get some boba. Hey, what's up guys? In this video today, I'm gonna talk to you all about my dream car and I'm sitting in it right now because I just bought it. So for those of you that saw my video on net worth, I mentioned this exact same thing as well. I want a Maserati. I've wanted one for over 10 years. This is the longest time I've ever held back on a purchase so far. So today we're gonna show you what it was like picking this car up. And I really hope you guys liked the video. And with that, I started my day out in Dallas and I'm driving to Houston in this rental 300C that I got from Hertz. So you guys get to basically see a day in my life on the weekend just to see what I do. Today I have an appointment down in Houston to check out a property and hopefully expand the empire. You see, originally I wanted to be able to buy a car by increasing my main job salary, but over time, I ended up challenging myself to pay for it with a combination of side hustles. Then that idea turned into making just one side hustle pay for it in a year. So I knew how bad I wanted this dream and I pushed for it. I got to Houston later than I wanted to and I picked up some food. Then it was literally back on the road because I had that appointment that I had to get to at one o'clock. So this is the property I was looking at. It was a duplex, which was renting for about 2000 a month. And I thought it would be good, but it needed a lot more repairs than I had initially thought, including the roof and a lot of plumbing and some other stuff. So hard pass on this one. Just going to keep looking and seeing if there's another one out there. Another thing I like to do is film for my YouTube channel. So I'm literally here at the Asian markets in Houston and I'm just filming what's out here. And I saw that those videos have gotten popular lately along with my Texas one. So I just had to do it. This guy I'm meeting with the Maserati lives on the coastline of Houston in League City. Apparently he used to own a dealership out there and that's what he was doing for like 20 years of his life. So it's going to be interesting to meet him and see what he's about. All right, so here's the Maserati. At first sight, man, she's pretty. Gotta be level-headed though, so I gotta check all the different things like brakes, filters, oil. Is there any ticking in the engine? Then I pull out my code reader just to check for the different codes and stuff if there's any. The emissions readiness is looking pretty good. The maintenance is looking fine on the menu here, but that could easily be reset, so I have to validate that properly. Radio and everything works. Just looking at the front of the car, everything looks really clean, even in the engine bay, so I was pretty impressed by that. And then took a look at the belts as well to make sure that they were all good and not cracked. Make sure all the different lights were turning on properly. Check the brakes, as he said they were new, you know, felt the rotors to make sure that they were all flat and the brake pads were really new, which they absolutely were all around. This is the 12th Maserati I've inspected, so I've had an idea of what to look for. There were some that shifted hard, there were some that didn't idle smoothly, some that were ticking, and those were things that I was looking for. None of those issues were prevalent in this car. After that, I signed the check, handed it over, swapped it for the title, and got two keys, and I was on my way. All right, roll the music. how big the tank is and how much it costs to fill up the Maserati Ghibli 1.7 and it takes 16 gallons $28.97 trying to return Hertz and it's after hours this sign here says go to Monroe Road and then drop it off in the back there so that's the Hertz return facility right there the problem is they're not open right now but that's fine so the car is here I have the keys in my hand right here and return the rental car keys here. So say goodbye to the Chrysler. There it goes. So here it is against the Houston airport. Sun. Wow. Can't believe it guys. So many years and finally here it is right in front of me. Oh my gosh, there it is, there it is. 
It's right there. There it is. Whew. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. All right, let's go for the start. Since there's no Jollibee in Dallas, I went down to Houston so I could eat some Jollibee. So here we are, and unfortunately I have to eat in the car because the dining room's closed. And some of you may pr frown down upon it, but that's fine. What's up guys, lovely day in Texas. And look, even the cars are social distancing. And by the way, there is the Maserati right there, right under the light pole, just had to see it. And after looking at some rental properties and filming some more things, it's time to drive back home. And guys, one of the key features about this car is the exhaust. That's the signature part of this car. So what we do is you press this twice, puts it in the on position, and the press sport button. See that right there? And then foot on the brake. Guys, that is my favorite sound ever. The sound of a Maserati exhaust. <laughs> this is what I like. This is, oh my gosh. <laughs> that sound is intoxicating, guys. And of course, can't forget the boba that I ordered. That was the main purpose at the start of this video. So in all this time that I've been working and grinding and all this, I realized that dreams don't just get fulfilled overnight. I've learned that I'm personally not lucky, but maybe you guys may call it that. For me personally, I've done a lot of meticulous planning and constant focus on the dream, and that's what made this work for me. So I really owe it to my parents and everybody else that watches this channel, everybody that hits the like button, everybody that's motivated me, even people that hate me and all that stuff like it's all of the combination of all those things turn it into what this is so i owe it to every single one of you thank you guys very much for making this happen this is what it's about if you guys have a dream put the plan together and chase it this is only the start y'all thank you very much for watching like squad hit that button and i hope to see you all in the next video goodbye